Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today we're going to check it out how to create an abstract knot in Adobe Illustrator. Okay, first step, I'm going to make sure that I'm on the stroke. So I'm going to swap this from this arrow. I'm going to click on the stroke. I'm going to select the black color. I'm going to select the circle. The ellipse tool, press and hold Shift plus Alt to create a circle. I'm going to press and hold Alt. Also press shift to isolate, you know, drag it to the right until they intersect right here. Select both, press control C and then control F or you can go to the edit and paste in front. So this way it's going to paste another copy on the front, press and hold shift, rotate it 90 degrees. So we're going to be left with this uh, circle wireframe. What we need to do is select these circles, these two circles, select them press shift plus M or you can go to, what is this? Shape Builder tool, select the Shape Builder tool, press and hold Alt. So this way we're gonna delete this area and just drag it like this. And look, it just deleted. Okay, I'm gonna delete these two circles. So now I'm gonna select Direct Selection tool, select this anchor point, go here and press on Cut Path at Selected Anchor Point, click and do the same thing with this edge too. There you go. Now they are, separated like this select both go to the object go to blend and make and we're going to double click here on the blend tool select specify steps i gotta go with um, i'm gonna try it with four click ok i gotta go to the stroke options select a stroke profile i'm gonna go with the first stroke profile and i'm gonna increase the stroke to width also so it's gonna look something like this from here i'm gonna select it go to effects distort and transform transform um, I'm going to create three copies. The angle is going to be 90 degrees. And let's see what we can do. I'm going to go with the horizontal first. And vertical. You basically need to play around with these numbers and check, you know, eyeball it, how it's going to come out. Let me check a little bit further. So for me, it's some somewhere on minus 137 per, you know, vertical 113. Click OK. So why is that much? Because it's a huge artboard. It's a 1080p artboard and I made the symbol really big. If I would make it really small, then, you know, the numbers would be smaller also. So, and basically this is how you do it. Thank you so much for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye-bye.